They just didn't yeah. want to see their daughter to get hurt. Yeah. But I think oftentimes when you don't give children that ability to freely express themselves in any way that they do see desire that they're just going to find avenues to expand that like Mm -hmm. i don't know what your childhood was like but i imagine you would have been a lot faster to violence or you would have been a lot more comfortable in violence Mm -hmm. like did you get into fights um as a kid in school yeah, well, my hometown's known for fighting. Like, I, you go out in Townsville and they'll say, where are you from? And you go, Mount Isa, and they go, oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and look at Townsville. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, like, Mount Isa's known, like, everyone loves uh, to fight there. But in a way, it's a good thing because they shake hands after and they leave it be. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So, like, my hometown's, yeah, pretty rough. And people love to fight and the girls punch on just as much as the guys. Yeah. Yeah. Do you get into any trouble out there? Yes. So... I have said before like that my mum probably doesn't want me to say it Mm -hmm. like some of the experiences I've had but I have I actually have said to her what makes you think that telling me to defend myself and fight these girls was gonna make me not ever fight like that was kind of paving the way to put me into this Mm -hmm. where I could walk into the ring being like I've done this before yeah do you know what I mean so like one of them probably the most um, talked about ones that people talk about to this day, like in my hometown, it's really like a history t- books. <laughs> <laughs> like a tale when they're all drunk, they talk yeah. about it. <laughs> I'm not even joking. And they, some of them talk as if they were there. <laughs> um, was when I like now pink is still my favorite color, but back then I actually stopped wearing pink because of it. Cause I used to just get picked, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. But I had like this full pink outfit on with a skirt. I don't know who I thought I was cause I'm in like a small country town and I'm just overdressed, you know? And anyway, I've just had like a group of girls come in and like they're rough as guts girls too. And they're known for being rough as guts. And they were like, you know, like, who do you think you are? Like, blah, 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 like come outside. And I called mum and was like, mum, I can't, like, I can't do anything. She was like, why aren't you outside fighting them? And I was like, I can't, I'm wearing a skirt. And then she's <laughs> like, <laughs> drove down to McDonald's. She's like, wait there. She's come down with shorts and made me put them on in the car. <laughs> and these girls are all standing there like, and then they're like, I was like, well, hold on, hold on. <laughs> put the shorts on and she's like hurry up <laughs> so oh the girls God. would have been like yeah i'm rough as guts this girl looks really easy target but mm. she just jumped in that car and put shorts <laughs> on i think i'm gonna have a tough ride See, most people call their parents they go i'm in trouble you need to get me Help. out of here <laughs> <laughs> yeah and your mum was like here take the pair of shorts and show them what you're made of yeah that's brilliant i think it's because when we're you're in a small town you kind of have to prove yourself because you'll just get bashed all the time if you don't mm. You know what I mean? Especially like for myself and because I come from such a strong family that are known for never backing down and being the, some of the strongest people, like having me then be like a pussy was like, you know what I mean? I couldn't. If you haven't already, please smash the subscribe button and you might also want to check out this video right here. Thank you and we'll see you next time.